Hey, it's David Farmer, and today we're going to be talking about the Adaptive Offer Technology. This is a system that is designed to prevent customers from registering multiple times from the same device. It's a security measure to make sure that there is no abuse in the Visa Reward Card system that you're utilizing at your dealership. It allows you to track the customer's IP address from the registered device and prevents that offer from being presented after a customer registers. Now, you may have the opportunity or may have the desire to be able to reset this IP address to ensure that the offer system is working correctly at your dealership. The adaptive offer technology allows you to add and or delete an IP address, allowing you to test that the system is working correctly. Let me show you exactly how the system works. Now, the first thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into enticedemo.com. And as you can see, I'm able to see the $25 Visa Reward Card uh, offer once I visit the dealership's website. And for this test, I'm gonna come in here and just go through the registration process. I'm gonna register with my first name, my last name, my email address, and my phone number. Once I make that registration, I can complete the process by scheduling a test drive at the dealership, at home, or at work. In this case, I'm gonna uh, schedule a test drive at the dealership. I'm gonna select a, uh, a specific time, day part, specific time, and complete the process by letting you know what vehicle I'm considering next and customizing my experience. Now, most of these things are optional. The most important thing is that we're gonna capture the customer's first name, last name, email address, and phone number. And of course, if they opted out at any point or abandoned that registration process, as soon as that customer enters that information, we are gonna convert that customer into a lead, um, and we are going to enact the adaptive offer solution. So now if I go back to this dealership website, I do a quick refresh, you're gonna see that this offer is now gone, it disappeared. Uh, I can go back to the home page. I can go to any page on the dealership's website and the Visa offer is not showing. The reason that is, is now we're tracking this device by the IP address and we're preventing that Visa offer from showing. Now, if this is happening at your dealership showroom and you wanna test that the system is working, you can uh, reset the IP address in the admin console. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over here and let me go ahead and just log out and I could show you from the very beginning. So I'm gonna uh, log in as a, uh, using my username and password for my test account. In this case, I'm, I have this little reminder. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, minimize that. I'm gonna go to tools and then I'm gonna hit admin console. In the admin console, most importantly, I have the IP address for desktop devices. Uh, this is tracking it. Now, it, it does show my IP address right here for this device. Uh, and what I can do is I can go ahead and hit the unblock this IP address button. At that point, now I've unblocked that offer or I've unblocked that IP address. And if I come back to my offer or my, my test dealership website, I hit refresh. You can now see that that offer is showing. In this case, it's in the tab state. Um, if you want to see that the offer uh, shows up in the entrance notification, you can furthermore do this test by going uh, into Chrome, deleting your uh, cookies, because we also prevent that offer uh, entrance notification from being shown by utilizing cookies as well. That cookie uh, is going to track the state in which that offer is showing. So now if I come back to the demo website, I hit refresh, you're seeing that the offer is now showing in that entrance notification, which I have the opportunity to minimize to a little tab if I want to. So in this video, what we've covered is the ability for uh, you to test that the entire system is in fact working 
on your dealership's website. It is just being excluded based on an IP address. One last tip that I'll share before we leave this video is that if you what if you ever do see that $25 visa offer is showing on computers at your dealership's physical location and you want to hide it, all you have to do is go back into uh, the Entice Dealer Portal, go into Admin Console, and when you're in the Admin Console, all you have to do is click the Block This IP Address button and it'll do the exact same thing as actually registering for the offer and blocking that IP so the offer will not show on your dealership's website at your dealership's physical location. Because generally speaking, once we block the IP address of the device, it's also going to block it for any other computers that is going to be showing up uh, on the dealership's uh, Wi-Fi router or on the, the, the hard-coded internet that you have there. So again, thank you so much for taking the time to learn a little bit more about how to delete your IP address inside the Entice Dealer Portal.